With finals right around the corner, it is important for you to know what to expect on the test. With no two finals the same, we talked to different teachers to get a breakdown of the exam. I think science finals are hard because you have to know a breadth of information versus um, remembering like certain terms. There's just a lot of concepts and they kind of vary. So I think science finals are generally harder. Well, one of the finals is a Socratic seminar, so you have to come prepared with answers to questions and then the discussion and your participation. 35 multiple choice-ish type of things and one long essay. Reviews are a vital study material, but can also help you with your grade in more than one way. I usually take them for extra credit, because if you're going to put the extra work in, then I will give you some extra credit. Well, that is for the students to use or not use, whatever their choice is on that. If I'm going to give them the time to prepare, then I'm definitely going to take a grade for it. If you're stressing out over finals, talking to your teachers is an excellent way to know what to prepare for, as well as finding out how your final will be constructed. I think it depends on the subject matter that's being tested. So all of the teachers are going to let their students know what their final looks like, how many points it's worth, um, the best way to prepare for it. So even the English finals, they're different based on the teacher. So it's really good for our students to ask questions ahead of time so they know how to prepare. With a variety of different ways to study for finals, you can never be too prepared. This has been Reed Smith for ONW Now.